Nothing. What are you eating for breakfast? What is it? A what? Cookies for breakfast. Best GG ever. <laughs> Good morning. It's Saturday. All right, so the other day I did go ahead and get uh, a new graphics card. And um, I'm going to go ahead and install it in the computer this morning. Um, so hopefully this will work. Fingers crossed. <laughs> All right, so that's where it goes. Well, got it installed, and it seems to be fitting. So now all I got to do is put it back together and plug it in and start it up, and hopefully it'll start up. What we have here, Jay? What is this? What we get? What Papa get you? It's playing on playing. What is it? Is it Lego? Here, let me, here, show it to Papal. Let me see it. Show it to, show it to everybody. Let me see. You can see here that has a flipped off the things. Oh. Right here, let me see it. Oh, that's pretty cool, isn't it? Yeah. That was only four bucks. Well, not bad for Lego. <coughs> oh. You okay? Morning sunshine. Morning. <laughs> Morning nothing shine. Morning nothing shine. I got the new video card installed and everything's going great. Got all the driver update and everything else. And so what I'm doing now is re-encoding a video that I just did last night to see if I'm improving any on my render time at all. And it looks like it's gonna almost in half going to cut my render time, which is fantastic. Um a 10 minute video that I sh shoot would take me about an hour to render. Not fantastic by stretch of imagination, but still, you know, half. I'll take that. For 40 bucks, I've spent 40 bucks to upgrade my computer and I'm going to reduce my render time by half. I will definitely, definitely take that any day of the week. So, woohoo! Thumbs up. So, what you doing, baby? Looking at Facebook. Looking at Facebook. Anything interesting on Facebook? Looks like Shauna Dunn's taking the day off to clean just like me. Mm. So the missus and I are thinking about going to the Taste of Cincinnati either later on today or tomorrow. I'm not sure when just yet. Um, why don't you tell them what the Taste of Cincinnati is, Glenna? Uh, it's where you walk around and taste stuff. Come on, I'm a Maryland Street reporter, so tell me, what do you think about Cincinnati, the taste of Cincinnati? Tell me what you think. What is it? Tell me what the taste of Cincinnati is. You're a Cincinnatian, aren't you? <sighs> Stage fright? <laughs> Will you stop? <laughs> well, come on, say, tell them what it is. I don't know if I can exactly, I'm, it's, it's a bunch of food vendors and bands and people every Memorial weekend. In Cincinnati. That's what it is. Hey, bud. I just wanted to say hey. See what you're doing. Fishing? Can I try? Want me, want me see, let me see how you cast. Can you show Papa how you cast? All right. Yeah, you gotta wait. You catch anything yet? Huh? I got a few. Got a few? All right, at the Walmart, I'm gonna pick up some steak and some other stuff for dinner tonight. I 
I didn't like the look of the steaks in Walmart. They didn't have any fillets, and I didn't like the ribeye. So I'm gonna head over to Jungle Gems. I got the corn and the green beans, but heading to Jungle Gems see if I can get some good steaks. Guys, live crawdads. That's what Baron likes to eat. Pretty cool, huh? Good. Ouch, that one got me. <laughs> okay, so you know the 66 figures that I picked up the other day from the Figures Toy Company. So I took them out of the package today. And here's a little bit closer look at them. And uh, I have to tell you, man, I, I'm really impressed with these figures. I think that they did a really, really good job on these. It's uh, the fabric and the cloth and everything. I mean, it's and it looks. I mean, it's um kind of looks very much like the likenesses. Uh, you know, to a certain degree, they definitely got the spirit down big time. And um, like I said, I am very impressed. I mean, the cloth, the detail, and everything else that they did. Just the little things like with the Joker because it's the vest kind of opens, this jacket opens up and the vest is underneath there and you can take the vest off. Really good stuff. And then just the, the question marks on the side there. So, um, very, very impressive with, with this. I mean, considering that they're 25 bucks a piece, uh, the, these are really good and they're gonna look great in my case. So I cannot wait. So Glenna has been working on the room most of the day and she's getting the closet better looking so it definitely looks better than what it did before but it's um still not done we're gonna have to redo the closet i think because we only have this section right here and then this right here it's just not enough room at all so i think we're gonna rip this out and then put like a dual thing there and then another dual thing right over here i think is what we're gonna do and so that should give more room and she wants to actually or i have another suggestion win the lottery buy me another house okay sure with i'll a get rid right closet on. okay and a soaking tub that has a whirlpool in it maybe a swimming pool just saying okay so apparently i am a millionaire now all of a sudden now uh i'm not According to TV, you don't have to be. You can just buy stuff. Yeah. So she wants to basically get rid of this area right here and turn this into a sitting area. Get rid of this shelf, maybe this shelf, and then put a mirror in there and a chair and some other kind of stuff so she can sit in the closet and put her makeup on. Because putting her makeup on right here, because this is the this is right in the because you can tell how far away the the bathroom is from this closet see here i'm in the closet now wait a minute wait a minute now oh my god now i'm in the bathroom oh my goodness that was such a long walk do you really want me to tell the real reason <laughs> why what's the real reason you have a bathroom yet you are always in here with me when i'm trying to get ready I want to escape. I need that closet to get away from everybody. And here I thought our love would keep us together. <laughs> it is the only thing that probably keeps us together. <laughs> uh. He said he wasn't tired, that he wouldn't go to sleep. Love my buddy so much. Did you snooze? Didn't. No. You was awake the whole time. Yeah, but why would I call this a rig? Uh, it's a dig. I don't know, man. Crazy energetic minds. So here's the steaks I got. I got a fillet, a dried ribeye, and then two sirloins. Mmm. Also gonna make some shrimp, grilled shrimp, some green beans, and then I got some potatoes cooking in the oven. So, dinner. Mm. It's 
not going to hurt you. They're probably dead, Jay. No, they're still alive. What is that? Soft shell crab? Yeah. A blue soft shell crab. Jimmy's going to make himself a soft shell crab. What do you think about that? He's going to make it touch me. And it has gone all snap me on my face. If it's alive, it's pretty lethargic. Yeah, they don't move all that much. Yeah. These are like their gills. Yeah. So basically, you cut their face off. Just a second, Jay. And then you peel those back and cut the the gillets off. You watch a video of how to do it or something? I've seen them do it on TV. Uh, and then you pull the tail back. And you really eat all that, but that right there gets super hard. So did everything else about the, sh the sh crab you eat other than what you just cut off? Basically, you can eat this tail portion, but it gets really hard. And obviously, I mean... Poopy? That's poop, but... <laughs> I mean, you can still eat it. It ain't like it's gonna hurt you. All right, everyone. I think it's gonna be it for today. I'm gonna go ahead and get this footage transferred to the computer. I'm gonna go see X Men, and then I am going to come back and then I'd probably have the footage and upload it. So that's what I'm gonna do for the rest of the day. Just worked around the house today. It was a gorgeous day. I didn't want to do anything at the house, but needed to be done. So that's what we did. So anyway, thanks for watching. Give me a thumbs up, subscribe. I will see everyone tomorrow. Take care. Bye.